A Phoenix nursing school under investigation and in hot water with the state board that could lead to a shutdown. David Caltabiano is live in the newsroom to explain this. David. Yeah, the state board of nursing has been investigating Aspen University for allegations that have yet to be made public because of confidentiality laws. On top of that, the rate of their students passing the nursing exam was way below the requirement last year. The violations could lead to the school closing their nursing programs to new students, a move the school has already made. I've wanted to be a nurse for many, many years. Angela Arnold just finished her prereqs at Aspen University, ready to learn how to be a nurse at the school's core nursing program, which starts next week. Until she said school officials called a mandatory meeting for her and the 55 others who were slated to start. They started telling us that they were having to close the nursing cohort um, portion and not accept new students. Arizona's family dug deeper and found that Aspen University was at the center of a state nursing board investigation. The details yet to be released because of confidentiality laws. The board was also concerned that Aspen students were not passing the NCLEX, an exam you have to pass to become a nurse. Only 58% of students passed in 2021, way below the 80% state requirement. They weren't even close. So far, no action has been taken against the school, but the board voted to offer a probation settlement. The 800 students in the core classes can complete their courses and take the NCLEX. The 700 currently taking prereqs aren't allowed to that next level. It leaves students like Angela and those 55 others in limbo since they finished the prereqs and would not be allowed to complete the program. I was devastated. <laughs> um, I cried for two days and I... Um... I didn't know what I was going to do because a lot of the colleges don't accept the credits for the prereqs from the other colleges. Aspen University sent Angela a letter offering her enrollment at their other schools across the country or 65% off tuition if they're able to accept new students in the future. But Angela says the options simply don't work for her. We paid all this money to do our prereqs. And we don't get that back, so we're going to have to pay more money. It's just not. Okay, so if the school accepts the terms by the board by next Friday, they will not be allowed to bring in new students in their nursing program until they hold an 80% pass rate on the NCLEX for one year. If they, don't expect the if they don't accept the terms, they could face disciplinary actions. We reached out to the university, and tonight we have not heard back yet.